Welcome everyone to the Titanfall 2 tech test is what they're calling it. I have no idea what to expect in this one. Um, this is again one of those blind beta tests or tech tests if you want to call it. So let's get started. This is the last weekend I think. Um, for those of you who are new to the channel, welcome. Uh, I am a mature working professional dude who just enjoys gaming. Some people enjoy reading books on their free time and things like that. I do enjoy reading books, but I also enjoy gaming. Um, hey, if Kevin Spacey does it in House of Cards, what excuse do I have, right? <laughs> um, so let's uh, let's get going. I have no idea what to expect. Again, this is a blind meaning I have not um, done this before. So let's do this. I am excited about Titanfall 2. I know they're focusing more on the story this time. I hope that plays out. Um, Respawn Entertainment, there you go. In the first one, it kind of, you know, didn't do very well because there was no campaign, so to speak, or storytelling element. But I never, I never played much of it on Titanfall 1, so I don't know what, I don't want to say anything bad because I've never played it. Um, but I've seen demos and things of that nature. Okay, thank you for helping us test Titanfall. The game is a pre-release stage of development. Um, this means that some parts of the game, of course, the kind of disclaimer that, hey, you know what, if stuff doesn't work the way it's supposed to, go easy on us kind of thing. I'm excited. Like I said, the collector's edition of this game excites me. It's very expensive. But, uh, you know, maybe I'll have to save up... Um, to buy it or something but I don't know if I want to go buy this game on launch day uh, I'm more interested in the story elements of this game to be honest but this is a multiplayer I think tech test so it's cool welcome to Titan Titanfall 2 MP tech test is currently live thank you for helping out uh, we want to hear all of your feedback find us on Twitter okay uh, let's see if we got the usual stuff turned on, uh, like subtitles and things like that, but I don't know. I think the training is going to be part of the play mechanism, so I hope it is. If not, we'll have to come back, do the training. Let's see. Except, it's a lot of stuff. You know, this document, I always have a funny thing about terms and condition documents. It's like the Constitution doc, you know, document. My God, who's going to sit here and read all this? Except. pilots and welcome to the world of Titanfall 2. Thank you for joining our multiplayer tech test. We're asking everyone to help us stress test an early build of Titanfall 2 and our brand new networking back end to find all the issues before we launch on October 28th. We're all really excited to hear your feedback. This is only an early look at Titanfall 2 and includes only a small portion of the content that you will enjoy in the final release. Make sure and head to our forums at Titanfall.com to let us know what you think. And thank you for your participation and support. For starters, we're giving you a look at two maps. Welcome to the dense urban streets of Boomtown and the open fields of Homestead. Each poses unique opportunities and challenges for both pilot and Titan gameplay. Today, we're giving you a peek at one of the brand new modes in Titanfall 2, Bounty Hunt. In this mode, you and your teammates are tasked with clearing the remnant field ground units through three waves, earning a bonus for every kill you obtain. Between each wave, make sure and bank your bonus points to increase your team's score. At the end of each wave, the remnant fleet will unleash a bounty titan. Once on the field, you must defeat the marked bounty to earn a massive bonus. If you need a break from bounty hunt, We've also included a classic 8v8 mode, Pilots vs. Pilots, in order to put your pilot mobility and combat skills to the ultimate test. As a pilot, you are the apex predator, and your arsenal has been greatly expanded. New weapons include the L-Star, a rapid-fire energy assault rifle, and new abilities like the grappling hook take Titanfall's mobility to new heights. This is just a sample of what you'll have access to, and as you progress and level up, new weapons and abilities will unlock to further expand the gameplay opportunities. So make sure to customize your loadouts and see what works best for you. And 
And of course, we're letting you try out some of the brand new Titans. In Titanfall 2, each Titan now has their own unique personality, signature style, and exclusive core ability that needs to be earned. Plus, a special weapon and set of skills that differ dramatically from the other Titans on the field. In this tech test, you'll get a chance to try out Scorch, a fire expert who controls battlefield positioning with his powerful thermite. And Ion, a power and energy specialist with the ultimate core power, her massive chest fired laser beam. Wow. Finally, we're also very excited for you to try out our new network system. Networks provide a friendly place to hang out between matches and truly elevates Titanfall 2's social game. You'll be placed in a default network to start, but you can join others that better suit your social or gameplay style. Or if nothing feels like the perfect fit, you can create your own network for you and your friends. Well, that covers everything you need to know. Now get out there and dominate the enemy team. But most importantly, have fun and make sure to check out everything Titanfall 2 has to offer when we launch on October 28th, including our brand new single player campaign. There you go. As a story-driven gamer, it goes without saying, I am interested in the story element of it. Um, it kind of reminds me of that Hugh Jackman movie uh, where his kid, like, part develops, like, this friendship with the robot. I can't remember the name of it. Um, it came, like, a few years ago. Um, you guys probably can leave me, in the com leave me the name of the movie in the comments, but it was a good movie. Actually, I remember watching it in, I think it was in the theaters, and uh, it was actually a good movie. Okay, so customize. I'm just gonna show you the menus real quick um, as I learned this too. I am excited about the grapple technique. Uh, that looks pretty cool in the cutscene. Uh, let's see what else we got. Um, Holo pilot. Oh, create a holographic copy of yourself, mimicking your actions when activated. Uh, pulse blade, throwing knife with a sonar pulse that exposes enemies through all surfaces. Grapple, of course, grappling hook for getting to out of reach places quickly. Strategic jumping enhances its effectiveness. Uh, and then stim, quickly heals you and boosts your speed for a short uh, time. Unlocks at level 6. Uh, the top one, or yeah, all the other ones are unlocked, looks like. Assault rifle, submachine gun. It's kind of cool. Damage. Okay. Consistent recoil SMG. Light machine gun. Steady fire rate with a punch. Sniper. Ooh, that looks badass, man. Scoped heavy rifle. Shotgun. Not bad. Auto loading shotgun with widespread. Unlocks at level 11. Grenadier. A single fire direct energy propelled launcher. Very cool. I like to try assault rifles, um, just to because trying to kind of you know go with the default of the game and see how it plays out. Charge rifle, anti-titan. I don't know what this does. Charge precision beam, anti-titan sniper. Uh, okay, magnetic grenade launcher. Anti-titan sniper. All right, let's just stick to that. Power cell tactical is more. Readily available, faster cooldown. Uh, hang on to walls by aiming while wall running. Kill report enemy death locations marked by skulls on the HUD. Uh, hover aiming while airborne allows you to hover. Oh, interesting. All right. Front rifleman closer. Of course, now that we've gone through all that, it will have different loadouts. Is what they're showing you. Okay. Titan, Ion, there you have it, Core, Laser Core, Laser Shot, Vortex, Tripwire, Scorch, Wildfire Launcher, the other one was Ion Kit is Entangled Energy, um, okay, Networks, My Networks, Browse, I don't know what all this stuff, stuff is. Network name. It kind of reminds me of Killzone 3 
where you could make like your lobbies and stuff is what it sounds like um, I am the advocate I can find work for pilots who have skills it is what he would have wanted join digs a better thing okay so see this, this is what that's what it looks like and my networks is probably where it's you know a given that uh, whichever one I want to like favorite or something like that maybe um settings okay all right let's let's see like I said I what is down below here uh, are these like networks these are probably networks let me see again though I think it down below like where I was like right here I think these are like quick access points for networks maybe or maybe they're names of people no, they look like gamer tags to me or I mean PSN IDs uh, I think if I click it what happens yeah, that's what it is. Just names. Happy hour starts in eight minutes. Earn five extra minutes per day during happy hour. Okay. Find game. Join network. Invite friends. Let's just find a game. Bounty hunter. What is it? Kill enemies to earn points. Earn more by banking bonus points at designated points. Um, capture and hold a hard point to earn points. Amped hard points give double points. And then pilot versus kill enemy pilots. Titan falls not permitted. Um, so let's do that. Let's actually let's do one without the Titan falls. Um, and let's start simple and see what we get. Homestead. There you go. I have to say, so far it's pretty good. I mean, for like a beta or tech test, um, you know, load times are okay. Uh, the menu was pretty okay, no major glitches, but we're about to find out. So I'm not familiar with the controls in this game because I've never played previous Titanfalls, but I've done FPSs before. I should be able to get the hang of it. It's like a mirror's edge thing. There you go, like that. Wow. I want to mute. Where is mute? Hmm. Well, you probably hear other players, but. Somebody's got a sniper. Whoa, what is down here, man? Oh, I see him. Ooh. Definitely nice tight controls, don't mind saying. There's me. Boom. Gone. Later. R2 oven is evenly balanced assault rifle. Yeah, I get that. Oh. 
graphics are pretty sick. You're doing a damn good job, pilot. Don't let that. That was a grenade, by the way. Oh, stop killing. I'm gonna go in the heat of the battle, man. Oh shoot, wrong one. Ooh, there's a grapple right there. Nice! Oh, he got me. Alright, let's try the other gun. I don't know what this gun does, but we'll find out. Whoa, dude. Jeez. I think I got him. I think. Yeah, Daniel, you should. Yep, I think I got him. Yep. Nice, 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 nice. Assault rifles perform best at medium range while aiming down sights. Yeah. Okay. I want to go up there, man. Yeah. And how do you freaking? Oh, I don't know. That did not work out the way I wanted, but let's try it again. I'm missing something. I'm missing something. Okay, hold on. Oh, camping, man. Campers. It's all good, it's all good. Amped weapons ready. Activate which left? What the hell is that? Okay, I have my reticle changed, I believe, but not sure what it will do. Whoa. I got him, I got him. Somebody is sniping. Not bad, actually, uh, for a tech test. I should have been looking at the HUD up there, but I was not, to be honest, much. I'm like trying to grasp as much of the game as possible, too. Oh! Sniper. I do want to see how you mute them. I mean, you can't, like, mute people or what? Oh, that's me, man. It's picking up my profile. I clicked and it picked up my profile. Stay on track. We're winning this one. Whoa, I see. I saw a sniper shot come from this side.
Oh, return to battle. Oh, shoot. Oh, man, I had that guy in front of me. I went outside the area or something. That's good to know. Good to know, man. That was me. Eliminate all enemy pilots. The Kraber has re to reload between each shot. Alright, I'm not sure all this stuff that's coming at us. Okay, so there you have it for that. I don't know what that was it said destroy on it, but um, I didn't see anybody shooting at it, so that was kind of awkward. Cool, I'm getting some stuff. All right. Neon locks, HCOG, R201 attachment. Scoreboard did not do very hot, but that's okay. Um, all right, so shh, close. It's searching. Hang on, let me just leave matchmaking. Just want to head back. I want to see what I unlocked. The like the H cog or whatever it was. Um, and then what is? Oh, okay, it's loading. What is jumping? Did I not say that I did not? Oh. Okay, I don't know why it's starting the thing because I did not want to <laughs> go into the match. This is uh, awkward, but okay. And I don't know how I'm going to get out of here, but. Kill everyone. Pilot, edit, game, leave match. There we go. Okay. Alright, so in the next part, what I want to try and do is I'm going to do a find a game, but I'm not going to do this one. I'm going to do uh, the bounty hunt. Um, and again, I don't know how the whole Titanfall thing works. Like once it's in there, does like one team member grab it or what? But uh, um, again, I'm having fun. Stick around. Uh, thanks, and I will catch you in the next one.